Hey there, this is Vanessa DeVerlay and welcome to my channel. Today, I want to show you where to find free B-roll and then how you can edit it into your video. I know when I first started making videos, I found a site where you could buy B-roll and it was like $79. I'm like, there's no way. Then I try to go out and make my own, which sometimes I do, but you can get it for free and I'm going to show you where. <laughs> Stick around. I think when we start making YouTube videos in the beginning, we are so worried about what everybody else is going to think of us that we don't have fun with it. And I've been trying to give you some videos on how you can do things yourself because I want you to have fun. I know a lot of your training might tell you that you have to look a certain way, you have to have a certain background, you have to talk a certain way, wear certain clothes and, and you know, make sure you have a certain, and all this stuff. And you just worry about all that, have a script. And then you sound like you're reading from a script. <laughs> um, take a script write it down and, and then just bullet point it you know don't just be natural and be yourself and you'll be fine but one of the fun things I think the things that's intimidating sometimes is the editing that goes into the video and nobody expects you to learn everything at once but if you start just adding like one new thing at a time it becomes fun and then when you once you master that you can do something else so what you're gonna master today or start doing is adding b-roll to your video and don't overdo it just add one or two just have fun with it okay let's go I'm gonna show you where you can get free b-roll and then I'm gonna show you how I use my editing editing tool. I use Camtasia and how I can edit it into a video and just make it a little bit more pleasing to the eye. The first thing I need you to do is open up your browser and go to www.pexels.com. -E okay. And when you get there, it's, they also offer free stock photos as well as videos, but this is the screen that's going to pop up. And I just want you to type in what do you want for your b-roll now i'm going to pretend i'm doing a cooking channel and i want to pull up some pouring batter okay so these are some photos that popped up now the, the, i want to show you that it pops up photos first go up here to the left hand corner and right here you can go ahead and select videos and these are different videos that are about pouring and batter. Now, of course, the first word was pouring, so you're gonna get pouring wine or maybe pouring beer or something like that. Uh, here's a lab. So um, usually the first word is the first main keyword that's gonna pop up. So when you wanna download a video, just click it. You can watch it first from here. See how many minutes it is. I think this one is like 19 seconds. It's not very long. Some of them are two minutes. Some of them are just a few seconds, but you have to decide, are you just using it um, to take up some space on your video? I find sometimes if I'm talking, and I know this is something um, that I want to be better at with the B-rolls, is if I'm talking about something and I'm using a screen sometimes just looking at that same screen can get monotonous for a person so it's a good thing just to throw in a b-roll so they have something to watch while they're listening all that you have to do it says right here free download look down here free to use when you click that when you cl click the free download they're going to ask you i'm going to do it real quick but i don't want to download it um there you go um it's going to download anyway. Um, you can donate if you want to say thank you. You can just say thank you. I'm going to delete that because I've already downloaded it. But this is up to you. Um, you can, if you feel like you use a lot of videos from one person and you want to give them a donation, that's the only way they make money here. And, you know, you may find a, a person that takes really good photos or videos that you really connect with. So maybe you can get more from them. Um, besides what's here for free. You can make some kind of connection. All right, so that's one. Um, let's try another one. Brewing coffee, coffee brewing. So um, there's another one. Let's do, um, I want to do more of a coffee. Coffee pour. Let's try that. Let's see what else there is. I did get this video here. I've already downloaded that one. I just wanted to see if there was more of a variety 
But most of these, there you go. This is a typical, um, when we think of pouring coffee, most of us <laughs> that aren't bougie, right? 15 seconds. So there, you're just, just pouring some coffee. And let's do that free download and see how that one works. All right. All right, now that you've downloaded the videos that you want to use, and you don't want to overkill it, you know, make sure it's relevant. I know people that will do B-rolls all the way through their video because they don't want to show their face. That's fine. Just make sure it's relevant and don't make it look like you're just throwing them in there for the sake of throwing them in. So what I did is I took them off of my desktop. That's where they were. Yours could have gone to a download folder and I just picked them up drag and drop and I put them here in the media bin. I use Camtasia, been very satisfied with this. It's very easy. I started using it two years ago and knew nothing about editing. In fact, my first probably hundred videos were nothing but me talking and I, and I used PowerPoints and that was it. I didn't know how, I think I was afraid to try things and I have found it's really, really easy. So please don't be like me and wait, just jump in now, especially if you're new, because you're just going to get better. So what I did is I put them in the media bit. Now Camtasia is considered like a screencast editing program software and you buy it once and you put it on your computer and that's it they do have upgrades and you can choose to get them or not i have not um, but one of the things um, that i love about this program is here in the media bin you might have things that you need every single time you make a video like when i'm done with this video i can say clear this out just get rid of it all and start fresh well then you got to load your intro back in and load your outro or certain things that you might use all the time well, Camtasia allows you to save them and you can just pull them up and boom, they're there. Um, you can save them within the pro software. So you don't have to put them on your um, desktop or whatever. All right, so we have our videos. I added another one because I told you, let's pretend we have a cooking channel. So this one here, I did a real quick little video about my cooking channel. I, I don't really have one. I didn't really make a long one. Um, let's move this down. The top track has my audio and the bottom track is the picture here. Now this picture, I'm going to um, make it so that you just see the picture and not all the stuff around it. You just kind of pull it down. And here I am, blah, 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 talking about my cooking channel. Well, I'm going to insert things. So let's move along and I'll show you how I insert them. Hi, my name is Vanessa and welcome to my cooking channel. Today we're going to get us a cup of coffee and then we're going to make some cookies and I'm going to show you all the other cookies for the holidays. So let's go grab a cup of coffee and then we'll get started. All right. So what we're going to do is we're going to take this coffee pour video and right exactly right there where I said, let's go get a cup of coffee. You see that? Now let's move on. So now I've showed you all of these different ingredients that you have to collect and blah, 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 blah. And I'm talking, talking, talking. And as I'm talking, I will show myself adding the B-roll with pouring the batter. And then I can show another B-roll of... Okay, so here I'm going to add the B-roll of pouring the batter. And again, you would, you would talk more and have more sequence in this and it would make more sense. Um making those cookies and putting some kind of a topping. But you get the point that you don't have to just look at me or look at my PowerPoint as I'm talking. You can add some things and just make it more interesting for your viewer. Okay, now what I wanna to do too, let's say that at the end of the video, I, you know, I keep talking and, I'm, and as I'm talking, I'll show you how this is going. But here you go, you might, you know, later share some things about your cookies and you know, finish up, let's put this glaze after you've gone through all the steps. But do you see how that makes it more interesting? How you, that's how easy it is to add these in folks. You just put them on a track right above and there you go. Now I want to do one more thing. This is kind of a bonus for you. Okay. I'm going to go up to track four. Now you got to remember, um, as you add things, if you want them to overlap, you have to go up to the next trap. But some people, like to add a little bit of music in the background. So if you're doing something fun, like making decorations or cooking or something like that, you can find some free music that you can use. There's no copyright, no charge on YouTube. Now I'm not gonna go there today, but I want you to know it's there on the left-hand column. But take that music 
that you download and bring this way down the sound like way down here and then you can very quickly watch how I add the music I won't play the whole thing hi my name is Vanessa and welcome to my cooking channel today we're gonna to get us a cup of coffee and then we're gonna make some cookies and I'm gonna show you all the steps to make my favorite cookies for the holidays so let's go grab a cup of coffee and then we'll get started Now it's a little low. I'm going to raise it just a little. So now I've showed you all of these different ingredients that you have to collect and blah, 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 blah. And I'm talking, talking, talking. Okay. So, um, I won't, I won't keep going. Now, the only other thing I want to show you, see how the music goes way out here and maybe your video ends. Maybe you said some more things about the cookies, you know, and the video is a little bit longer, but when you want to cut that off, go up here to edit. And see where it says split all you split it and see how I split that off and then I can delete that and there's my little video that we just made so it's that easy to add your b-roll I hope this will inspire you to add b-roll to your videos it is really easy this program is very easy to use I do have a link below if you haven't chosen your editing software yet um, I highly recommend it. Like I said, I came in no experience. This has been very, very, very user friendly. Now, if you're more advanced and you know there are more advanced things out there, then by all means. And um, thank you for watching and I'll see you on the next video.